Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to have a look at how you can create a Word document from a photograph of text. In the, and in the Word document, you can then edit the text. So I've got a photograph of an old document, an old exercise that I had printed out but lost the original file on the computer. So instead of starting again from scratch, what I've done is taken a photograph of the exercise on the paper and then inserted that into a Word document and saved it as a picture. And then what I'm going to do is save that as a PDF. Once you've saved it as a PDF, you can then reopen it as a PDF and you will be able to edit the picture. So that's what I want to do. So first of all, if I go to the insert tab and get the picture that I took with my phone, which is this one. This is the exercise that I've lost. So I just took a picture of it. It's not a great picture, but all I did was, is if I right click on this, I can save this picture as so basically, I emailed this picture to myself and then I saved it as this one, which is what it's already saved as. Save. Yep. And then what you have to do is save this file, this Word file, as a PDF. So if I go File, Save As, Browse, wants to be a PDF. So I'm going to leave it as doc1 because that's what I've been using all the time. It's just going to overwrite the, the previous one. So I'll just save that. It's going into documents. Save. Yes. And then I can delete this picture. Because what I now need to do is open up the, the PDF file through Word. So file open. And... Because I've been using it already, it's in today's list. So that's the PDF file that was created. When I open that, it should open that file. And you can see now you can edit this. It's not perfect. It's inside a table cell. And there's a few little boxes here that you can get rid of. But what I suggest you do now is just highlight this text. Get it out of this table. And then try and... If I cut that, Control x just paste it underneath... Control V, then get rid of this table. Just Control X, cut. Now you can see it's not quite aligned to the margin. The indents are off. So if I triple click in the margin area, you get, you see the indent marker there. You can just pull that across to the correct place. And you're then going around through this and editing it the best you can. These are just wanting sentences to end. So you just fix that. But now I've got this as a file. At two, I think that's meant to be. Two days, I think it should be. It stays at two days duration. So I've got the original hard copy, so I can just double check everything's correct. But what the, this benefits me is that I've now got an electronic copy of this file. Um, which I had lost. So I can resave this. And then I've got the best of both worlds, hard copy and a new electronic copy of a document that I've lost. So that's all that I want to talk about in this little session. Quite short, but basically you can take a picture of an old document if you've lost it and get, get it into Word, save the picture, create a PDF, open the PDF, edit the, the text and then save it as a Word file. Now you can do that with scanned documents, photographs, as I've already said. Anything that you've lost but you've got a hard copy of, you can then recreate it and save it for future use. So hopefully that was of use to you, and thank you for your time. We'll see you in the next one.